tiny spirit crystal? Don't do that. And don't make fun of me. Sorry. Wouldn't want you to cut yourself. The rock is sharp as hell and, you know, super magical. It's an amethyst crystal. It helps to keep you calm by blanketing you in protective energy. I know. I remember. If you know, then don't call it a rock. Maybe I just feel like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop outsourcing the job to a crystal. Makes you feel better, maybe you're right. Um, maybe you're right, but guys, we've got bigger problems right now. Maybe you're right. But you don't have to be an asshole about it. Oh, I didn't mean to make her feel insecure. Okay, maybe that was a shitty thing to say. I'm sorry. It's fine. This isn't a time or place to... I have to tell you something. Okay. Earlier, you brought up that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? It wasn't a job, not really. What are you talking about? Remember my friend Murray? He was setting up a studio in Brooklyn, Fine Arts. He wanted a partner. That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought you'd tell me it was insane, rightfully. Because it would be. Should have chased your dream, why didn't you go for it? But should have gone for your dream, follow your dreams. I mean, did you ever think maybe of chasing the dream first and making it work practically second? Clearly not. I'm here, aren't I? Things were already starting to get yeah. tough for us. Oh, that was no, weird. no, no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. Aww. Surprised. Didn't think, I didn't think about that. Say nothing, stupid choice. I don't know. Say nothing. I don't know what to say on that one. Oh, you're not going to say anything. I, I just, uh, what do you want me to say? Guess I was holding out for things to change with us. Deep down, I'm still hoping. Should have said it before. I was honest about my priorities. Maybe you should have said something before. You should have said all this before. I know. I'm not going through it all again. What if this time is different? Oh, come on. That's not likely, and you know it. Sorry. I guess I'm a little confused. We better go. Let's get back to Aaron and get the fuck out of here. I want to say I'm all for your relationship and all, but... Charles seems hell-bent on You know, there's a, him, there's a so maybe, psychopathic yeah. serial killer. We should probably worry about that first. Wait, where was that? She was down the hall. Oh my god, the, the walls are going to change again, aren't they? Make a mental note of where we're going. Because I feel like these walls are going to start changing again. Wait. What's that? Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? No. Is that her? Yeah. Shelby. Matching nails? God, don't. We always got them done the same. That's him. What? That's him. The guy in the back. You know him? He kind of did. He was just... One of those guys that was always around. We'll be at some of the same parties, but that's it. It was my fault. You know that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. It was a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. And Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and that's when, they, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? 
I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! Holy shit, they're the worst <laughs> change <laughs> I can't hold this. Listen, you have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out now! Jamie! Charlie! What the hell just happened? I, I don't know, but I think it's really, really bad. So is the killer here? Oh god, I'm gonna jump. Is the killer here? Now the same killer that fuck. killed her friend, sister. I, I don't know what the relationship yeah, between her and Shelby was, but has to be. There's a killer here, some fucked up jigsaw-like killer, and now they, this whoever this killer is, knows about some history with Kate. Oh, I don't like the fucking dark. God damn it. Walls are changing. Uh, What's going on? Demet, what the hell is going on with him? He was nervous the whole way here. I chalked it up to him just being eccentric. There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. Let's think about this. You saw Dumet take Dumet. off. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? Maybe. Or maybe he's in cahoots with the killer. Or perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. And the dude in the mask is? Oh. Instant tick. So either we're being that chased by a that's killer, a a that's Dumet, that or... planned out, every bit of it. It was set up for us to find. Which makes it even more likely the dude on the ferry wasn't really Dumet. Aha. Uh -huh. Good thinking. So either Dumet is in cahoots with a killer, or the killer is Dumet, and the guy we met isn't, um, um, what do you call her? Mother fucker. What? Brick wall. Keep going. Just I know, I don't want to think about it. Thing is, I don't know if we could be going in circles with all these walls changing. We could literally be running around the same bit all the time, and I genuinely have no idea. I don't know which way to go. It's like a maze. Well, that's a dead end. But it might not be a dead end because the balls might change again. I'm trying to map this in my head. But I think Erin's room has been completely cut off. Jesus, Charlie. Why is he messing with her? Oh. Because she's the most easily frightened. The most vulnerable. Don't you watch? Oh, what the fuck? Is that a kid? Oh, good. You hear creepy kid voice too. I was worried I was finally snapping. Where's oh. it coming from? Investigate the child's voice. Oh, there's something over here. What is that? Oh, it's another token thing. I still don't know what these are. We're like five parts in. I'm worried. So if that guy we met wasn't do met, the guy who got the fairy now, why is the child here? Charlie, come here. Let's get this open. It's not going to be the real kid. It's going to be a cassette player. I know it. There's going to be another fucking sword trap. It's going to be a cassette. Oh, no, no, no. That's a fucking saw. That's straight out of the Saw movie. I'm sorry it is. That's the fucking bathroom from Saw. Don't go in there. Okay, it's not the bathroom, but come on, tell me this isn't inspired by Saw. No, you fucking idiots. <laughs> Why'd you let it shut? There's a psychopathic We're in a serial killer. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? A doll in a doll in a doll. Are oh. you losing your shit? Because I don't need that right now. We're locked in a kitchen. Trapped is this, in this a, a body hotel, bag? Stranded on an island. Even if we get out of this room... How do we get out of the hotel? Exactly. There's gotta be some way out. 
Maybe we just focus on one thing at a time. This room first. You're right, of course. Charlie, I found a way out, maybe. But it's locked. Look, this one swings out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. But what's gonna be on the other side? That's not what I was expecting. Ah, me! Shit. Ah. Charlie, grab your lighter. We need. Oh fuck, she's unconscious. Charlie? Fuck. And Aaron. I she... know somebody was in there. Oh, Aaron, please don't go exploring. Please just stay in your room. I. I. Can't. Breathe. Relax. Slow, deep breath. In and out. There was somebody in the room we know. Oh my god, she's gonna pick up the voices from like the next wall or something. Because somebody's watching us through the windows. Mirrors, whatever. God. Where's the jump scare? Where's the jump scare? They gotta hear this. No, Aaron, Aaron, sweetie, stay please. in your room. Please. Aaron, please, just stay in your room. <laughs> oh, fuck. We locked in. Guys? Hello? I mean, I know I wanted to stay in that room, hey. but not like this. Charlie? Mark? Jamie? <laughs> Aaron, honey, if you got your inhaler, because that looks really dusty. Aaron, inhaler. Oh, come on, come on. Stop being such a damn wimp. Okay, okay, you got your inhalers. You got two of them, I think. Oh, God. Aaron, inhaler. Inhaler, yeah. Get back to you, let's explore the passage. Oh, I don't know. Can I use two in one? Wanna... Any sounds? I don't know if I need the torch more or the speakers more. I'm trying to keep some different listen out for audios. Oh. You know what's worse? You won't notice, but as I'm doing the thing. Treatment for what? Um, genuine snake oil made from the finest king cobra. Oh, hope we don't have to. But what we can't see is, it, what you can't tell is because that my microphone is beeping. Okay, is there any noises? It's like a, wait, what was that? It's like a boom sound. Oh, no, no, no. Creepy dummies. Oh my god, is that even a dummy? It looks... Oh, I really don't like that. That looks... They, that one doesn't even look like a dummy. That one looks kind of real. The phone. Ah, uh, I know probably if you're watching this, you haven't seen my Doctor Who series I did, but we did that series and there was like weeping angels and shit, and I'm now paranoid to turn my back on like, like statues and that. And there's a way to inspect it. Can you see that flashing like behind his hand? I'm not fucking inspecting it. Oh, I really don't like this. It's a phone. Well. Fuck you, Jamie. 
Who is the cutie in the pecky post? Said totally your type. You are so predictable, Jamie. Who? Erin, please. My type is badass bitch. No timid woodland creature. She's shy. She's clueless. Her face always looks lost and confused. Erin, sweetie. This definitely wasn't Jamie who said this. Right, quick look around. <gasps> Wait. Oh, thank God he's still there. Okay. Sorry, I, I got paranoid now. I think something. Oh, God. This Jenny is fucking creeping me out. Hate say chums. Glitchy shadows. Is it wrong that this game is scaring me more than the quarry? Oh, are we gonna get a premonition? No, it's just uh No, Aaron don't No, can I back out? Sorry. Since the fucking hat incident, I am not taking any chances. Check for any noises. Fuck. Dead end. Oh, is it a dead end? Because... Another door over here. This way it looks like it's to a hallway and it's locked. Fuck. Dear Mr. Thomas, why did you why don't you leave me the hell alone? I'm wondering if I check this again, will it have changed? No. That's what I wanted to double check. I'm gonna have to check that fucking creepy man again, aren't I? Oh, there's another door. There's another door. Is that, is that the door? Is that another door? Is that the door we came in? Oh, fuck a rubber duck. What's behind you? There's something behind here. There's a tape. Aaron, oh, hello? fuck Jamie? me. Jamie? Oh, don't do that game. Aaron? You there? Uh, hello? Can you hear me? What is happening? What? You're not safe, Aaron. How are... You have to listen to me. Do exactly as I say. What's going on? I saw your text. What's going on? I'm more confused. I'm scared. Jamie, what is going on? Where are you? I don't... Just listen. Listen. There's a cupboard in there. You have to get inside right now. What are you talking about? Just hide, Aaron. Why are you telling me this? What's happening? Aaron, now. Just trust me, okay? <gasps> Aaron. Do we listen to Jamie and get in the cupboard? Because what if that's not Jamie? What if there's some sort of like impersonation of her? Oh, oh, please be right, please be right. I don't know. Oh, this is probably a trap, isn't it? This has to be a fucking trap. Oh, thank God I didn't go for the door at least. I'm glad I listened now to the voice and hid because I was really fucking paranoid. Charlie? Jamie? Hello? Where the hell are they? 
Hopefully somewhere safe, wondering where the hell we are. Kate, check this out. What is going on? <laughs> are, are we locked in here? Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? You hear that? Is that them? Where's it coming from? Somebody's in the restaurant. It's a cassette. It's a cassette tip. Oh, and that's just my cross that's fucking creepy. Mark and Jamie, the two they did my boy Mark do it with no hair. Of ten. And, and Jamie Kate, as well. Despite our bickering, you Kate's are not so bad. You keep people interested. What the fuck is this? Mark, what are you doing? Just stay back from it. Disturb? What the hell is Charlie going us into? They're only mannequins, not disturbed. This is beyond messed up. I don't know what Charlie's gotten us into, but if I see Dumet, I'm going to fuck him up. Oh, I'm with you, Mark. I'm fucking with you. I was just now thinking. Something just clicked in my head. So, going back to now when we were just with Aaron, um, I listened to what Jamie said. And hid. How did Jamie communicate with Erin? How did she do that? Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet? Look, we can examine them. I swear, if one of them starts fucking moving, I'm gonna scream. I don't know what's going on. Oh, I just realized. As well, not only like the mannequins, they, they look, they weren't our exact outfits. How the hell did they get a hold of our clothes? Oh no. No, back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh, thank God. Sorry. I was genuinely just expecting the man because I had to just go poof, and turn. Oh, painting, 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 painting. This is one going to give us a premonition. But why would he invite us here and to dinner and then just leave? There's two doors. That one's locked. They're both locked. Is there like keys or something I need to be finding to unlock them? I just realized other windows locked as well. Can't be. You must be mistaken. No, it's a cupboard. It's the map? Oh, I don't want to go out yeah, there. Yeah, that door ain't coming. I don't know why I'm pulling my camera out. Time's n now's not the time to take a selfie, man. Uh, we... Erin, Kate... Oh, I really don't like that. I don't have like a fear of mannequins, but this is beyond fucked up. Charlie? Have you got a key, Charlie boy? Jesus. It looks just like him. No way somebody just threw these together in the last... You hear that? Footsteps. And they're doors. getting closer. Who is it? Watch out. Okay. It's going to be Jamie. It's going to be Aaron. Who is it? Not gonna be Charlie because he's in the. I don't know who is it. Oh, it's Jamie. <laughs> Jamie. I leave you your head in, Jamie. I'm so glad to see you guys. We have to get the hell out of here. Yeah, no Ken. Glad you're okay. What happened? Probably what happened would be what happened. What happened when the wall closed? The Met killed his groundskeeper. What? Right in front of us. Like a fucking saw movie. The Met? It's a setup. He was wearing a mask, and I know how that sounds, but I'm not joking, and now he's after Aaron, so we need to move. D Wait, hang on. Where's Charlie? I don't know. We got separated. No way this is happening. You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side Are you of the fucking lake, kidding me? Bodies dead. Jesus, dead. shut bodies it up! Bodies dead. 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 Oh! Who was that? 
Oh, Jesus Christ. This... It's fake. A prop, or from an animal or something. It has to be. What if it's not? No, 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 no way. Oh. Aaron, don't touch it. Oh! Oh, it's real! It's fucking real! I told you! This was all too much! Let's get out of here. Okay, guys, let's not go wandering off, okay? Let's all stick together in one group. Oh, it's locked! What's going on? The door I came through is locked too. <coughs> Two men! You wanna play around? Get out here! Right now! Let's fucking play! You wanna play a game? Oh, I say no, do you, do you also saw code? Is it like, do you want to play a game or I want to play a game? Fuck, I haven't seen a saw on the phone in a while. Hello, Charlie. I mean, yeah, I know you've been kind of a dick for the past three episodes, but I'm really glad to see you're alive. That's the main thing. Oh, but someone was in here. They took our lighter, but for some reason didn't take Charlie. But now we got no light. Is this a prison cell? Sorry, I know I keep making fucking saw references, but that's all I can think of playing this. This door's gonna be locked, surely. Yeah, of course it's locked. Okay. So. Oh. What's that? Key. Oh shit. Oh. I knew the key was, it was not going to be that easy to get the key. Careful, Ty, it's going to be boiling hot. Cage key. Okay, perfect. Well, we know where it's for then. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. What was this? Jamie! Hello! Can we not climb that? Jamie! I'm okay! That looks like a way we can climb. Wait, can you climb? No, it's just inspect. Oh no, because it's close back up. Okay. I was just thinking, like, can you not just climb up back up there? Okay, whoever was in here didn't want to keep us trapped in here. Uh, like, whoever the killer is. And the killer knows stuff personal about us, as we saw with Kate earlier. <laughs> Photos of what? Is these birds? Wait, no, that's a- these are dead bodies! Chicago killer victim 2, call of death, abominable owners, victim teeth have all been removed. Oh, God. John Doe number two. I'm assuming you broke my report on the first one. Similar MO, unidentified male with multiple stab wounds. Looking at the lower abdomen, the wounds are consistent with those of the first victim. The shape of the entry wound suggests it's a strong probability that this is the same murder weapon. Looks like we've got a souvenir hunter here. This time the left ear has been severed. Clean incision. Probably a scalpel or razor blade. Very tidy. Nice job, actually. Very little bleeding. The deceased had probably been dead for 30 to 40 minutes when this was done. This differs from the earlier MO. If you remember, that John Doe was still alive when the teeth were removed. That would have created a lot of noise and mess. This guy is learning. Okay. Wait, does this suffering on the back? No, I, I couldn't see. Um, that, that, the, I like those little cutscenes. I know they're too, but they're really cool. I really well done. I just like the whole murder mystery. I should say, my mum, she she loves like murder mystery documentaries and that. Sorry, I thought I could see something glowing. She she loves them. She watches like true crime channels or something. I don't know. It's not really my style. 
Wait, hold on. Is that, that's not our cage, is it? No. I was checking because the cage there. Oh, wait, is it this cage? No, it's that cage over there. Somebody's watching us. The only thing I can see is to pull this down, but I don't know if I should. Power out. I don't trust it. Okay, you ready, Charlie? Charlie, grab it. And... No way some psychopathic serial killer would make it that easy to escape. And the fucking music as well, ooh. Okay, there's two ways. There's that way, and there's that way. Oh, oh my fucking god, I've just seen. Is that a stick of dynamite? No! It's much worse. It's a mannequin of doom. Oh. Oh. Please tell me this way's locked. Let's see if we can go that way. That's creepy. What does this one do? <sighs> Closing my eyes. Oh, does it unlock that way? It's okay, so... We got this way. And we got that way. I'm trying to get... I'm about to say something which I never thought I'd ever say in my entire life. But I'm trying to get into the mindset of a serial killer. Would he... Set that up so we would go this way? Or... What do you think? What do you think that we would go this way? So didn't set it up so we go that way. I I don't know. I'm confusing myself now. I'm hoping I'm making sense. It's like a some sort of boiler room. Oh, and there's another one of these. I'm really expecting like a mannequin or something to fall down. Didn't I just go the way I should have gone? Oh, it just seems to be some sort of dead end. Oh, we need no, there's. Can we. If I. How do you grab again? There should be a way to grab. I've forgotten it. How do you grab again in boxes and stuff? Oh no, I can just squeeze through it, never mind. Sorry, I thought I had to actually move the box. I'm an idiot. Like, because I know in some of the other levels you have boxes and now you have to move. Another thing of doom. Wait, is this, is this a dead end? Oh, fuck that. Because there's no door, I don't know what that's gonna do. Oh, I oh. chest of drawers. Not chest of drawers, but. Locked. Okay, use us. You know how there's all the, like these. Oh, wait, wait, I'm a fucking idiot. Okay, bring that back up. D. Charlie's got his thing. There we go. Oh, another token thing. Still don't know what they do. Um, what I was going to say, you know how we've been finding locked doors, like, along the way? Are there actual keys I can find to unlock these doors, or are they just locked in there, like, you just can't enter them? Okay, 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 breathe in, breathe out. We're going to flip the switch, and hopefully I don't die. Okay. 
No, no, I don't like this. Here we go. <laughs> What did I just do? Oh no. I don't have why didn't I just go the way I came? No no I had to I had to be a smart ass, didn't I? I had to I might have just set some fucking soul trap off again. This journey? Like Change this around a bit. This could generally be a fucking Saw movie. Oh, now that gate's open. And the mannequin's gone. Like, the... Was that what was making noise? Was that like a little speaker in there? Did I just burn someone alive? I'm not going crazy, right? This Jenny is like a soul game. I know there's actual soul games, but... What was that? Sorry, it just went like fucking scary dramatic when I went in there. And I can't use this door, so this is the only way I can go, unless... Okay. Well, here goes nothing then. Hello? Charlie, now's not the Wait. time. Really? Praise the Lord. Charlie, you're stuck. It's real. Charlie, you're stuck in a place with a serial killer. This People have died. You watch them die and you're worried life. about fucking cigarettes. Charlie, you fucking set your priorities oh, straight, man. Fuck's sake. Oh, that's why he wanted us in here, didn't he? Well, this is where we die. <coughs> Guys, let's make sure we don't split up. Oh, the bartender's gone. What's he doing? Just out of reach, aren't they? That's gonna collapse, isn't it? Oh, unless that's the way out. Oh no. Oh, this isn't gonna fucking ignite, is it? Is that like like what is it? Nitrogen? Is that is that explosive? What's an explosive gas? Hey! Hey, hello! I'm here! Like one spark and kaboom. Oh! Hello! <laughs> it's his match. Oh no, this place is ripped to blow. Charlie, whatever you do, don't fucking like that, no matter how much you want a cigarette. Almost 
No, don't, don't, don't give up now. You almost said you've lifted up once. Come on. I know it's getting hot. Charlie dead? Things are starting to heat up for our friends. Yeah, they have. Charlie's goose may be cooked. But is he is he dead? It can be difficult working with someone you've been involved with. But I think Mark and Kate may be finding a way and learning some new things about each other. And how do we feel about Mr. Dumet's lovely animatronics? I fucking hate them. I think they're rather clever. Some of them look very realistic. But too realistic. I wonder where he sources the parts. It would only be fair at this stage to offer up a little hint to even the odds. Y what yeah. What do you think? Yes. Let's take some inspiration from the works of Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Apparently, our friend Herman Mudgett was so enamored with Sherlock Holmes that he borrowed his surname. Oh, that's what the home. Mm. I, my joke about him being the evil Sherlock Holmes is Here. true. <clears throat> he has a brain of the first order. He sits motionless like a spider in the center of its web. But that web has a thousand radiations, and he knows well every quiver of each of them. I hope that helps. So he's like at the center of this hotel and like the entire hotel hallways and has like one big web. He can see all of them through his cameras and change them to whichever way he wants. I think I understand. You'd better get back to things. Best of luck. Best of luck. I might have just killed Charlie, mate. Well, um, I've, 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 I've fucked up, didn't I? Yeah, I've got one of them killed straight away. I've, I've made a terrible blunder. My brain was thinking if I went for the door, like the serial killer, whoever it is, is on the outside. So they're gonna like maybe stab him or something. I, I don't know. But then I remember, shit, I just remember, didn't the serial killer kind of help Aaron? Like with the inhaler. So maybe. I, I don't know. It feels like I'm dealing with some sort of. Cyst, a sick twisted serial killer. Where he the killer himself. Want kill. He want stab. He want like brutally murder anyone. Right. But he creates like these fucking traps. Which will kill them. So if the person can escape the traps. The killer want. I don't know indirectly kill them. I, I don't know. I'm just try, I'm trying to guess. What's going to happen. But I've made a terrible, terrible mistake. And I've let Charlie be killed. Because I thought if I can get into the, in the gate. He could crawl out. And then like hide from the flames. I didn't think it meant he would pretty much bury himself alive. And burn to death. Oh, I'm such a fucking idiot. Well, as Charlie's death is. As we pay respects really to Charlie and his burnt corpse i'm gonna leave this video here on a bit of a disappointing note so one down 
There's four more left. Can I get the others to safety? Only time will tell. But with all that being said, leave a like on the video if you did enjoy. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Take care and I'll see you guys in the next episode.